We're now going to look at removing and renaming sheets in our sheet list in the Publish dialog box. So you can see at the top of the screen we've got 08 Removing and Renaming Sheets, Complete, and you need Removing and Renaming Sheets.dwg to follow along to the video. OK, let's have a look now at the Batch Plot Publish dialog box again. And what we're going to do, we're going to do a save first. So we save up here, and we're going to save it to this one here, 08 Sheet List DSD. That's the one that will be in your working files when you go look for it. These ones here that I've saved are just from previous drawings. They won't be in your working files. So that one there you want, 08 sheetlist.dsd. Click on Save. Now, it will say, do I want to replace it? Yes, I do with the drawings I've already got here. So we need to remove and rename sheets. Now, the first thing we need to do is remove the one from the Model tab. We're not going to be plotting that one. So I can click on it there. I can right click and remove like so, or you do have icons, plus and minus. So if I click on minus there, that will remove that model tab, which is known as a sheet in the published dialog box. So let's get that done first. Now we need to rename. Now I've got three different A3 landscape tabs. I've got landscape, the first one, and then two and three. What we're going to do is we're going to rename each of these. So I select that one, right click, and I rename the sheets. Now I can edit all of this. It won't rename the drawing file. So I'm going to go to there, click there. All of that can be removed. So that's going to be one dot A3 landscape, like so. And what we'll do there is to make sure that the tabs each have their own name like that. That's going to be one. And then I press enter. Then I save that to the DSD file. Now I could do that each time. It's actually quicker just to go in and rename each one first and then do the one save. So again, I click before the A of A3, come all the way back, and that's going to be two dot, and then that becomes A3 landscape two. Same again here, rename sheet, click in front of the A, backspace all of that, and that's going to be three dot, like that. So we've got landscape one, landscape two, landscape three, like so. All saved, nice and neat and tidy. So we've done a remove and we've done a rename. So now we go back here and we save to our sheet list again. Click on save and that'll make sure that we replace it. Say yes, that's all saved. Now I could just go ahead and publish. I'm not going to because there are some more settings that we need to look at in our setting up before we make any changes. So what I'm going to do there now is just close that. It's been saved to the DSD file, we'll be fine. And that's done. So that's our removing and renaming sheets in our DSD file, ready to publish, done.